Um, you know, we started STC play today, and players always show up when they need to. What was working for you today? Uh, just curveball, really. I use that in advantage counts and just getting ahead. I think that's the biggest thing as a pitcher at this level. As long as you can stay in advantage, you're, um, you know, in a better position for two strikes, obviously, and get more strikeouts and um, soft contact. I think best we can tell you had never gone 100 pitches before last week, you went 100, 109 tonight. How are yeah. you feeling as far as your durability and then working deep in the games? I feel really good. I put a lot of work in the offseason. My body's ready, and uh, Coach Kinsley does a great job of preparing us to, you know, be in this situation and go deep in games. You and I were talking about a week and a half ago about, you know, getting this Friday night moment at the SEC. Uh, now that you've had it and to have the type of performance that you had, how did, how did that all feel? Felt good. It was weird. Obviously, the weather wasn't ideal. So, you know, the fans weren't all out there. But once that happens, we'll get warm weather out here and, uh, you know, 12,000 people packing the stands will be in a, a good spot and ready to go. Is it tougher to go throw that many pitches in the cold versus the heat? Or do you, do you even notice that? I don't know. I think, you know, you kind of zone out in the game. You don't really feel your body. And, uh, you know, afterwards, I might be feeling that. But uh, give me a couple hours. You go single in the first, and then Robert and Jalen turned a, a double play behind you. How big was that play uh, just to, to get your feet underneath you? That's a confidence booster. I mean, anytime you have a, a ground ball or a double play, it's uh, great to have those guys behind me, and I know that they're going to make the plays. So a lot of confidence to throw it over the plate and get contact. You also get a leadoff double in the fifth, and they had their, their best guys coming up, but you struck them out to get out of it without allowing the run. What was the key there, and how big was that maybe for your confidence? Just executing pitches, that was the big thing we harped on all week. They're good hitters, they have good numbers, and I knew they were going to get on base. I wasn't going to throw a perfect game. So, you know, just execute with runners in scoring position and everything will take care of itself. And Robert, I know y'all only scored the one run in the first, but y'all made their pitcher throw a lot of pitches. What, 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 how big was that first inning for y'all? Uh, I, th I think it was just um, more than anything, um, you know, our offense just had a lot of confidence that uh, the the hitters approach and uh, the game plan that we had was going to work. So, um, you know, he had a lot of run on his pitches and he was an easy guy to square up. Um, but I think that bat Turner had where he had like, was it eight or nine pitches and ended up walking. Um, whenever you see that as an offense, you're like, oh, we got him. So uh, props to Michael for that. Coach Van Horn was saying that the weather that you guys saw in Round Rock was probably – a little bit worse than, than what you faced tonight. Uh, obviously, it was a real cold night. How much did it help prepare you guys that you had played in something similar to this, if not worse? Um, Round Rock was cold. Round Rock was really cold. But um, whenever you're running around out there, it's a little warmer. Robert, you faced him in, in practices. Uh, it seems like hitters get a lot of contact against him, but but they have a hard time getting a lot of hard contact. What, what do you think that is? He's got two different breaking balls. He's got a slider and then he's got a big breaking ball. And um, it's just hard to key in on one whenever he's locating both of them. So, uh, and then he, he can also, um, you know, whenever you feel like you, you're, you're on it and you're seeing it, okay, now here's, here's 90, 92. So um, he, he can mix and locate his breaking balls. Yeah, Robbie, you had a lot of good swings tonight. It seemed like the home run you hit was probably – you might have hit the other ones harder. Did you think that the ball was gone when you left the bat or, you know, the wind was kind of moving out? But just kind of what did you see on the home run and, you know, what pitch was it? Um, I, don't, I saw the replay. It was down out of the zone. Uh, whenever he did that OO, I just kind of left the approach and I said, I'm just going to try to go yard. So, um I, 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 I kind of like check swung a little bit. They didn't follow through, but um, it was something down out of zone. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Yeah.